started this school with the burden on my heart to train children, young and old, um, for change in their life. And um, the school started um, January 19, 2009. started with just one people and um, later um, we had three people enrolled. Um, I started with one teacher, um, one cleaner, a typist and um, we stay with that population for that session till the session 2010 and 2011, and the population increased to 23. Um, it has been a great journey, and um, I love every day of the moment because of the passion I have for the job. Uh, I'm a trained teacher, um, but what makes the difference in what I am doing is the love I have in teaching, imparting knowledge to children. Because when you impart knowledge, uh, the right knowledge, you can make a tremendous change. And that's just my passion, and I love doing it. It's been nice working with these children. They are loving, fun to be with. They are like my children. And although we, as a teacher, we are meant to be foster parents to them, do, but the children are loving, they are cooperative in their own little way. When they are being taught, they try to understand whatever thing their teacher teaches them. And even if they do not understand, they like auntie. Probably you ask them question and they are not able to understand. Or to probably give you an answer. Then you get to know that they didn't really probably get fully what you taught them. The experience working with Daisy School has been so exciting. It's been loving. Daisy School is one of the best schools in this area. It has affected people's children's life positively. I've also benefited from it. Since the establishment of the school, we've faced a lot of challenges. Um, but because of the passion I have for the job and the help of God, I've um, been able to overcome some of these challenges. Um, one of them is the, the bad road network in this environment which has really given me uh, a lot of headache. Um, even the school bus we are running, um, up to this moment, we are still running at loss. But I just believe that as time goes on, things will get better. Uh, other challenges that I face here, uh, the environment where the school is situated, the people living here, they don't really understand the program, uh, the kind of education that Daisy School is here to provide, um, but I believe as time goes on, they will buy the idea, they will understand and uh, have a better understanding the, the kind of program we are here for. And uh, also we have challenges of uh, not having qualified teachers that have passion for this job. As I said earlier, that uh, the, the, the zeal what pushed me on in this job is the passion I have for teaching. Um, and the, the Bible made me to understand that in every challenge, we should see it as a stepping stone. And I see every challenge that I've faced in this place to make me to work harder to make this place a better place and um, 
make it uh, a role model for learning. Working with this Z school is one of the most delightful things that has ever happened to me. Why? This has a very good standard. Working here for some years now has really helped me to excel as a musicologist. Often a time, most parents want to disallow their children to get involved in musical activities because of poor understanding of what music is all about. When Toby was admitted into the school, he was such a very shy boy. Finding it difficult to relate with people and even handle anything as far as learning is concerned. But since he began to learn music, Toby, who used to be a very shy boy, is so social now. Not only that, as at the time he was admitted into this school, he had a lot of flair for musical instruments, but he finds it so difficult to handle some. Perhaps he must have been discouraged by some other people who told him he could never learn any instrument. But since I began teaching Toby, as I would teach every other child, who really desire to learn. Toby has so much improved. Within a space of two years, Toby has excelled as far as learning the piano is concerned. I am in year two. I love my school because my teacher makes me more intelligent. My name is Aras Matalan. I am in year six. Why I love my school because they impart knowledge in us, discipline us, and teaches us well. My class teacher, her name is Miss Lilian. Why I love her is because she disciplines us, teaches us well. And she also told us that it's better for us to read now and to study hard to become better things in life like doctors, um, engineers, teachers, bankers, accountants and so on and so forth. I'm a parent of this school and I have two children in this school, one in year four and one in year two. We have been here for the past one year and in this one year I've noticed a lot of changes in my kids, especially my first son who is in year four. He had a speech problem. But with this strong class in the school, his speech has improved. He talks smoothly now and he's better now with his speech. I came across Daisy School by chance but I'm glad I did. First of all, I had um, the privilege of coming across the facilities that Daisy School offers, and I chose to visit the school. On coming here, I was not disappointed, and since then, it has been a testimony. I have two children in Daisy School. One is in year five, the second one is in reception class. These children, they have gone far with computer technology. Right now in year five, they have gotten up to Excel. This is something I did after graduation. My son that is in year five is already taking that package. The one in reception, he joined this school from daycare. If I just drop him here in the morning, till I get back home at after six, there is nothing for one day he did not fall sick.
about the Parents Teachers Association in Daisy School, it is left completely in the hands of the parents, which is not so in most private schools. The authorities of Daisy School does not interfere into the accounts of the PTA. Instead, the authority assists the Parents Teachers Association in carrying out projects that will be of advantage to the pupils and the parents. Daisy School have really done a great impact in the life of my children. I have four kids in Daisy School. I was having problem when my kids first of all came in because what the teacher teaches them is different from how I assist them. I had to call upon the proprietress, which now taught us about the diction, how to teach a child from the foundation, which are a book. It looks funny, but that is how we started learning it. And we're able to make impacts in the life of the children and even me myself. It makes them know how to pronounce things earlier and better from where they are coming from. Trainings and retrainings are constantly organized for the teachers during the long vacation and the holiday breaks in between. Children are handled with utmost care and love. Today we'll be going on to lesson one. Alright? Let's listen to the model speaker. How is English spoken in Africa? I am Mrs. Abraham. <laughs> I am Mrs. Abraham. <laughs> I am Mr. Abraham. <laughs> How should English be spoken by the Africans? I am Mrs. Abraham. I am Mrs. Abraham. The future of Daisy School is very bright. Very, very bright. When I came to this environment, you know, the, it didn't really tell me that I'm in a, a local environment. Uh, I know why I'm here. And uh, I try to put in the best, the, the, the way I know how, and um, I think the result is coming up. Um, by the grace of God, in the next five years, we are looking at increment in population, increment in staff strength, um, looking at areas where we can help the community, and also, we, we are looking at having other branches, um, having secondary school, and um, with boarding facilities. And um, we believe in the next five years, um, there's going to be a tremendous change in Daisy School. Um, because we are going to have more capable hands and, and we'll be planning trainings for our teachers so that they'll be able to deliver because you cannot give what you don't have.